about 9.58 uh, in the morning, officers from Mission uh, uh, Patrol Division uh, were in the area of Lower Canyon and Osborne. Uh, they saw a lone driver in a, in a Honda that's uh, parked behind me. Uh, they saw the driver commit a traffic violation. Uh, they tried to pull the vehicle over. The driver fled, resulting in a short vehicle pursuit. Uh, the pursuit entered the northbound fire freeway where the driver exited here on the off ramp to, to Terrabella. The driver lost control of the vehicle here. Uh, as soon as the, the car came to arrest, the driver exited the car armed with a handgun, resulting in an officer involved shooting. What we know so far is that at least one officer fired his service weapon at the suspect, striking the suspect. Uh, the suspect has, was transported uh, from the scene by, the, by our local fire department. The suspect is currently being treated at a hospital. His condition is still currently unknown. Uh, what, what we have here at the scene is Force Investigation Division. We'll be conducting a thorough investigation along with investigators from our office of, of our Inspector General and investigators from the LA County District Attorney's Office. Any questions? Yes, yes so there is, the, there is a handgun at the scene here. Uh, it will be recovered by Force of the Investigation Division of Personnel. Anything else in the car itself, additional weapons, drugs, anything else that they've gone through it yet? Uh, at this point, this is very preliminary. Uh, I'm unaware of any additional evidence that's in the car at this point. What can you tell us about the suspect? Uh, you know, at this point, we know that at least one officer fired his weapon. Uh, there may be more individuals, but uh, once again, at this point, uh, we, we that still needs to be determined by Force Investigation Division. What was the traffic violation? I'm sorry. What was the traffic violation? You know that that has yet to be determined. Uh, Force Investigation Division will be reviewing all body worn video, digital and car video, to try to see exactly what occurred at the onset of this investigation. Uh, the initial reports were that this was a reckless driver. Exactly what violations occurred, that will be determined. What well, can you tell us about the driver, the suspect, male adult? Uh... You know, it, it's a male Hispanic adult, uh, unknown age at this point. Uh, we, we have no further information uh, on the driver. We've got a couple of cars that are behind the last black and white machine. Were they initially involved or did they just get caught up in what happened? Yeah, a, a lot of the, the, uh, the cars that are here behind me arrived after the incident occurred. Uh, when the incident occurred, um, obviously exactly who was here present, that still has yet to be determined. We also will be looking for additional witnesses that may have seen this incident, drivers that were driving in the area at that time. Did the suspect fire any shots at the officer? Uh, at this point, that has not yet, yet been determined. This is very preliminary. We still need to review body-worn video, other evidence at the scene to determine what exactly uh, the suspect did with that weapon when he exited. What, what I have here is Commander uh, Hamilton, he is the, the uh, Operations Value Bureau uh, uh, Chief. Uh, he will provide a quick statement on, on the community aspect of this investigation. Sir? Thank you, General Bell. Uh, so, sir, I'm sorry, sir. First name, spell your name. Uh, my first name is Atlan, A L A N. Last name is Hamilton, H A M I L T O N. That's the commander for the Los Angeles Police Department. I'm the acting commanding officer of Operations Valley Bureau. Uh, just a quick note to the community, uh, we do not have any outstanding suspects and there are no danger to any of the communities of Pacoima, Arlita, or any other areas of the valley. Um, we have one suspect identified in this incident. Uh, that suspect is being treated at a local hospital. We have no further information regarding uh, his status. In terms of the officers, uh, none of our officers were injured as a result of this morning's activity. Uh, they are being uh, separated and uh, they will be interviewed by our Force Investigation Division following uh, Los Angeles Police Department protocols, and uh, they will be returning to duty in a couple of weeks, um, barring any other uh, administrative issues. Uh, in terms of the community itself, um, I just want to thank everyone for being cooperative uh, this morning in, in light of this incident. Uh, there have been a lot of um, traffic closures and other things going on with both the 5 Freeway and with Terabella, and uh, we are really appreciative of the community's support uh, in this ongoing investigation at this time. This, this location, uh, Terrabella Street between Laurel Canyon and um, Sharp is going to be closed for approximately five to eight hours for the remainder of the day. The five freeway, all lanes remain open northbound. The Terrabella off-ramp will remain closed uh, throughout this investigation.